Now to our weather, it's been a really dreary Tuesday across the region, but there is light at the end of the tunnel. Larissa is keeping track of when we'll see a drier day. Yes, tomorrow, Jim. Tomorrow okay. we'll see a drier day. In fact, we don't have to go to tomorrow because take a look outdoors right now. It's actually so much drier compared to this time yesterday and so much drier since this morning. We still have that cold front that's draped and sliced over the middle half of the state. Hasn't quite cleared our area just yet, and that's why it's so overcast. One once this front clears here later on this afternoon, behind it, the air is drier, and we're also looking at quieter and clearer conditions to unfold as we head towards later tonight. Currently, notice your 24-hour temperature change. Yesterday at this time, temperatures here in Philadelphia were struggling to get out of the 50s. In fact, we stayed in the 50s. 59 degrees was a daytime high yesterday. The last time we saw those cool temperatures was back in May. Current conditions right now, not as cool. In fact, we're a little bit warmer, sitting at 63 degrees here in Philly. If you're in Trenton, you're right at 60. Wilmington, 63. Same deal, Atlantic City, Millville, sitting at 64 degrees. Up in Allentown, only in the 50s. Meanwhile, the Poconos, you're at 54 degrees. Overcast conditions from north to south. It is a dreary Tuesday for sure. And later today, those temperatures top out at 67. Those clouds will be sticking around, and it is going to turn a little bit breezy in the afternoon with those winds consistent out of the northeast between 10 and 15 miles an hour. Let me walk you through the rest of today because it's not going to be a bad day. In fact, by 4 or 5 o'clock, once that front of boundary really clears, we may see even breaks of sunshine. Unfortunately, the days are shorter, so once the sun sets, those clouds will continue to clear and we'll see a nice shot of the moon, hopefully some stars, temperatures diving down to the 60s here as we head towards the evening hours overnight. We're back in the 50s, but we are looking at mainly clear skies, and we're going to give way to a beautiful middle of the week. I know many people will enjoy tomorrow's forecast. High pressure will begin to build over the area. That'll generate two things, abundant sunshine and milder afternoon temperatures. Around 71 degrees, a daytime high here for tomorrow afternoon. Just going to be an overall beautiful fall day, so take advantage, and winds will be relatively calm out of the west at around five miles an hour. Now, high pressure sticks around here through Thursday. Looks what, look what it does to our temperatures. 76 degrees a daytime high here on Thursday. By Friday, here comes our next disturbance. This is going to be dropping in Friday afternoon. We'll see some showers linger through the start of our Saturday. But I think the biggest story here with this gym is how warm we become on Thursday with highs in the 70s. And then we're back to the upper 50s by Saturday, but we're nice and quiet by Saturday afternoon. Thank you, Larissa. Appreciate it.